Hi, uh, uh, this is GIMP Beginner's Guide. Uh, we start discussing our tools. Now, this is your toolbox. Here, you can access your tools. And every time you click on a tool, here you get to see that tools options. <coughs> now, before we actually start to discuss each tool individually, I just want to go through this two options menu so you know what is all this for. Now, uh, every tool, like I said, has options. Click on this arrow and you get the two options menu and some other stuff here. The two options menu uh, gives you the opportunity to, to save your options. For example, you have some options, some presets you made. You may save them or access them, restore them. Right now I don't have anything saved, that's why I, I can't restore any options. I can rename already saved options or I can delete them. I can also reset my two options. So for example, if I have made some presets here, whatever I've done, I can just reset them or I can choose to reset all tools options. This will affect every tool that I have made changes to. Um, the next thing you, we can add a tab here for example we want to add a navigation tab uh, I recommend that you don't put any other tabs here we have plenty of space to put tabs on this <coughs> um, window here so let's get rid of that close it now uh, I've said this before, but just a reminder, if you accidentally close your tab like that, you can access it from Windows, Dockable Dialogs, two options, and then grab it here and just put it here. Um, something else, you can lock your uh, tab to dock. Uh, basically what that means is right now I can grab it and take it out, making a floating dialog. But if I choose these options, I can't do it. If you this, uh, do this sometimes by mistake, often you can lock your tab so you don't have to move it. I recommend you leave that on. You don't want to move this tab at all. Um, next thing is show button bar. This is your button bar here. If you turn this off, you won't be able to see it. Leave it on. Here from that button bar, you get some quick uh, uh, access to some of these options to save again to restore to delete options or to just quickly reset them um, that's it next video we start to take a look at our rectangular selection tool bye for now